his cheeks looking fresh tonight help me celebrate the man of grace dr kayo de tomomu tonight as he brings us god's word come on john let's celebrate jesus Let me celebrate Apostle. Apostle, I celebrate you, sir. Thank you, sir. And uh, mommy, God bless you. Now, uh, all protocol observed because uh, we are on um, um, we are on um, fast train and fast play. So, uh, all the servant of God, thank you so much. God bless you. And um, like I said, all protocol observed. Why we remain standing? We are going to read this scripture together because tonight, I don't know, something is going to happen. And I want you to get set. God is going to visit us like never before tonight. And from beginning to the end, it's going to be very hot. And I don't have time. Now, it said in Genesis, why we remain standing? It said Genesis 35, 16 to 21. It said, and they journey from better. And there was about a little way to come to Ephrat. And Rachel traveled and she had hard labor. And it came to pass when she was in hard labor that the midwife said unto her, Fear not, thou shalt have this son also. And it came to pass as her soul was departing, for she died, that she called his name Beloni. But his father called him Benjamin. And Rachel died and was buried in the way to Ephrat which is Bethlehem. And Jacob set a pillar upon her grave. That is the pillar of Rachel, uh, Rachel's grave unto this day. And he straight journey and spread his tent beyond Tower of Eda. May the Lord bless the reading of his word. Holy Spirit, take charge. In Jesus' name. Now we can be seated. God bless you. Now I'm preaching from one of my books. And to confirm my message, when Apostle was mentioning the several books I've written, when he got to that book, he paused. Because you can't hear the topic of that book and something will not spark your head. I will not die before my glory. Can you say it to yourself? He didn't know what I want to preach. It has been heavy in my heart. When I announced to you yesterday, his father one died, that is what I meant. When I say kill and go, that is what I meant. Heavy. Heavy. In fact, yesterday, it's as, it's as if I should preach that message yesterday. But something said lay foundation. That was why I lay foundation. But it was so heavy. Listen to me. If you are in this convention, God sent you here. Because glory is coming. That new beginning is talking about glory. It's talking about glory. And the message you are hearing now is that when that new beginning start, you will not be in the grave. Alia, Kariaba, when you have suffered, you, you are looking for money, you are looking for what to eat, you have suffered, and now that new beginning is coming, so that you will not be in the grave. That is why you are listening to this message. Am I communicating? I'm, please follow me hard, follow me hard, because I have something inside there that I want to bust to post. Am I communicating? The Bible says they were coming from Bethel to Ephrath. Ephrath is a place God has ordained for. God told Jacob, take your family, go. And they were coming, long journey. Long journey, long journey. And the Bible says, but when it was but a little way to get to Ephrath. Now, hear this. Ephrath is an Hebrew word. The English meaning means a fertile land, a good land. It's an, Ephrath is an Hebrew The English meaning means fertile. It means good. It means beautiful. You can call it glory. You can call it new beginning. When it was but a little for them to get to the land of Ephrath, reach a hard, hard labor. Aliyah, Giria, Pariasa, hear me very well. Today, I come with the anointing of the Holy Ghost and I pray for you. Every death waiting.
waiting for you at the junction of your glory. If your amen done that, they will die. Please, uh, choir, can you help me get mic? I need people that can be shouting amen. Take mic. I need people that will spark me up. Yes, sir. About three of you, take mic. Amen. Alia, yes, listen to me. Why, when they started the journey, Rachel did not die. She had hard labor and she died. Hey, listen to me. Back at home, I have a book that I used to preach. I call it Book of Elders. You can't see that book in the market. It's custodian of words of elders. So when I mention it, you don't say, let me go to market and buy it. You can't see it. They are with the elders. Now, in the book of Elders, chapter 15, verse 1, like I said, you can't see it outside. Though. Book of Elders, chapter 15, verse 1, what did he say? There is no smoke without fire. Jesus. You can't see that book outside. They are with the elders. So I'll be quoting from it as I'm preaching. So that, you know, say, let me rush to the supermarket. You can't buy it. They are with the elders. Hey, listen hey. to me. Hear me. Hear me. Re hear me. Rated when it was bought a little way. They started the journey. No complication. No death. At the middle of the journey. No complication. No death. When it was a little. Listen to me. Every parent here, you need this message. When you have labor for your children. Hey. Apostle, can I sit down? Thank you, sir. Listen to me. When you have labored on your children, when there was no money, you sent them to school. When things were hard, you sent them to school. When you cannot even pay house rent, you sent them to school. When it is time for you to sit down and begin to enjoy your children. Ah! That, listen to me. That is why this message you are hearing is a generational message. Yes, Let it enter into you yes. and fight to it. Yes. If you are here tonight, God, well, congratulations to you. Amen. God brought you here. Amen. I pray for you today. Amen. God, that want to kill you before your glory. Yes. There we die. Amen. Come on, shout amen like thunder. Amen. Lift up your right hand and shout, I will not I die before my glory. I will, I will not, not die, die before my, my glory. glory. Shout, I will not die before my glory. I will not die before, die before my glory. My glory. Now listen to me. Among all my seven books that I wrote, that is my best book. Because I wrote it out of passion. And listen to me, I told you, America does not save you from battle. Yes, sir. Am I communicating? Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. America does not save you from battle. Mm. I told you yesterday about the woman from one of the states in Nigeria. She lives in Texas. A professor at the age of 60. No husband, no children. That cannot be God. Am I communicating? Yes, sir. And she lives in Texas. And the battle grew worse to the level that the demons of her father's house will come all the way from her state to come and torment her. Those demons does not need visa. And they don't need ticket. They will just appear in her dream. Torment her and go back. Listen to me. I am sent to you. Yes, all the way from Africa to come and tell you the glory you are looking at, you will get it. That no beginning. That no beginning. That you are expecting. No beginning. Because after this convention, I see doors open. Doors. Amen. I see doors open. Amen. I see doors open. Amen. For you. Yes, Lord. You will not die. Glory to God. Is somebody following me? Yes, sir. Are, are, are we are we together? Yes, sir. There is something they say at home. I will say it locally and I will interpret it. They say, Oh, go dear me, son. Hmm. Let me interpret it. Glory come and life gone. Hmm. Glory arrive and life depart. Hmm. Am I communicating? Yes, sir. Servant of God, without life, you can't use glory. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That is why I brought that mention of warfare to you tonight. So that when we start to pray, you don't say yes. Mm -hmm. So that you can rise up. That was why I was talking about kissing yesterday. If they have kissed, don't wait for them to kiss you before mm. you pray.
Mm. Pray like somebody that is wounded. Mm. Because I see people flying here. I see you flying. <laughs> here. Listen to me. I'm hearing a word now. You are struggling to even pay your house rent. I heard that a time is coming. You will buy houses for people. Amen. Amen. Buy houses. You will buy houses. You are even struggling. That is what I'm hearing. A mighty apostle, sir. Yes, sir. A mighty wave of glory is coming, sir. Yes, sir. It's going to be like tsunamis. Amen. Apostle, it's going to be like tsunamis. Amen. I see God taking this church to a new level, sir. Amen. Amen. Apostle, sir. Your year of many labors, God wants to reward it, sir. Amen. Amen. Apostle, sir, this little, little prayer you are praying now, because of what you have done in the past, God will be bringing bigger results. Amen. Amen. Are you following me? Yes, sir. Please follow me. Follow me. And do you know the reason why you must not die? If you die, people will continue with their life. The thing they bite me. The thing is. The thing is biting me. The thing is biting me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, 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 because when you see me preaching yesterday, you will see that man is a teacher. I'm a teacher and I'm a lion. Hey. Yes, because sir. Jesus has two sides. Yes, sir. A sheep and a lion. Yes, sir. Hey. When it needed to be a sheep, it will be a sheep. Yes, sir. Hey. Thou shall love your labor as yourself. As Thou shall do something. <laughs> that, uh, 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 sheep. <laughs> but when lion needed, he took whip. And flood them. In the church. Hey. <laughs> Listen to me. A sheep does not flow people. That is what listen to me. What I'm preaching to you now. If you are only a sheep, they will eat you. If you are only a sheep, they will eat you. They will eat you, sir. But listen to me. When you sit and you push sheep aside, you take lion. Hey. Listen to me. Even when lion is sick, they don't bump out where to go and greet him. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, lion sir. is sick. And lion says, I, I am sick. And God now form association. Let's go and greet lion to greet him for his sickness. <laughs> association of goods. <laughs> Yesterday was sheep, today is lion. Jesus. Ah! to me. Hey. You must not die, sir. Yes, sir. Apostle, sir. Yes, sir. I said you must not die. Yes, sir. Excuse me. Yes, sir. Rachel was the love of Jacob. Hmm. Or, or, uh, am I right? Yes, sir. He served for her hmm. 14 years. Hmm. But when Rachel died, hmm. Jacob continued with his life. Hmm. Hmm. It's in the Bible. Hmm. And he said, he said, he said, he said, and Jacob journeyed. Hmm. He continued. They buried Rachel on the way. Hmm. Ah! Hey! Hey! They buried Jacob. Hey! Jesus. They buried him on, buried her on the way. Yes, sir. Jesus. Apostle, sir. Yes, sir. I still radical change coming, sir. Amen. what made me to write those two books. I will not die before my glory and winning the battle of life. That winning of battle of life is one dozen battle that Rachel fought. Everybody look up here. Let me ask you one billion dollar question. Where was Rachel when Joseph became prime minister? Are you talking? Are you reasoning? Servant of God. God bless you, sir. Where was Rachel when Joseph became the prime minister of Egypt? Thank you, sir. So when I tell you to pray, if you are not praying, you are doing yourself. 
So I see money coming, sir. Amen. And you will sow. If I go here, yeah. you will sow. You will give. You will sow. Amen. See, I will sow. I will sow. I will take off free from you for the church. And when I call you, you rush out. Because I'm a living example of what I'm telling you. Excuse me. I was in Jerusalem this year in September. And they were taking us on convoy. They take us out. This is where they bury Jesus. This is this, this is this. And as we we're going, sir, our host, the person that teaches us, he, he pointed out, sir, out of the booths that we were. He said, This is where Rachel was buried. Excuse me. It was by the roadside. They couldn't take us there. It was as we were passing. He pointed. The mother of Joseph that became prime minister. Mommy, she was in the grave after she labored. It was shot behind him that killed Rachel. Look up here. It was shot behind him that killed Rachel. But she never waited to enjoy. Jesus. Jesus. Am I talking tonight? Sir. You don't know. Jesus. That is why you must refuse to die. Because your husband will continue life. Your wife will continue. Your children will continue. Once in a while, they will say, Ah, oh, we remember mommy. Three years remembrance. Four years remembrance. Five years remember. Some of them have gone with their life. It is you. Hey! hey! Stand up on your feet. Pray this prayer. Hey! Hey! Because I'm watching my time. I'm watching my time. Pray this prayer. I want you to pray. And I want you to pray. Those on the mic, please help me amplify it. Yes, sir. You are going to pray. Every forces that want to kill me before my glory. Yes, sir. Every Can you say it after me? Every forces that wants to kill me before what my glory. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? In the name of Jesus. Every force is waiting to kill me for my glory. What are you waiting for? Die by fire. 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 We are afraid. I will see. I will walk out with the apostle. How we are going to organize a prophetic meeting because we don't have time and i'm a man under authority i love authority that is why god has brought me to where i am now i i hate breaking protocol apostle sir we organize time sir god there is a lot on this one sir we can do vg and if it is not Fiji, it can be daytime like this. When people can attend and let us pray. Let us, we need to pray, sir. Listen to me. Sir, Apostle, if Rachel has opportunity to be in a meeting like this, she will not die. Yes, sir. I believe. Yes, sir. Because what some of you are praying, you may not understand. You are taking 10 years ahead of you. 15 years ahead. Do you know? Do you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The reason why you are not facing attack now, that glory has not come. And it's coming. So what you are doing by this prayer is to clear the road. Some of you, nobody is touching you now because you have nothing to show. When Rachel started the journey, nothing happened to her. At the middle of the journey, nothing happened. But when it was a little for her to enter into billions of dollars. Apostle, this thing is deep, sir. Yes, sir. So we will let me just leave this or pray. I want to close. I want to close. Because I, what I have in my diary here, I, I want to close. You, do you get what I'm saying? Okay, let's go to prayer and prophetic now. I want to stop. I, I'm not preaching again. If I go into that message, I have, why did Rachel die before her glory? I have it here. About. And it's in the Bible. I will show you one by one. This is why she died. So that you too, you can avoid it. Apostle said yesterday, listen to me. We hear this very well. Apostle said it yesterday. We walk by common sense. Am I communicating? If a child wants to walk, he doesn't need to go to school. 
All he needs to do is walk further. He pick up again. Walk further. That is how you started working now. As you, you now became big babe, you become big guy. You two you fall and you rise. Common sense. Come on. Yes. You drive by going to driving school. Am I communicating? Yes, sir. But when you want to fly, you fly by instruction. Pilot fly by not by feeling. A pilot fly by instruction. A pilot cannot say, I don't feel like pressing this button. You, your plane will crash. Press it up, run up. When you are going to come down, you, you can't say, When you're supposed to land, I don't feel like, I don't feel like. And God will help you. Your fuel will not finish up. Instruction. So, when I tell you reason why Rachel died, I'm giving instruction to avoid what she did. But I won't go to that. Let's go to prayer. I'm prophetic. Buy the sir, they will buy the book. <laughs> that two books together, sir. I wrote 12 reasons why battles. Can I give you one? Yes, Let sir. me give you one before we go into prayer. Yes, sir. Excuse sir. Let me give you one. Before we go into prayer and prophetic because of our time. Sir, Rachel was beautiful according to the Bible. But she was graceless. No grace. Everybody look up here. Look up at me. Leah was ugly, sir. But she was grateful. She carried grace. So when you ask me, sir, I will tell you, I will rather be ugly and be full of grace. And to be beautiful and be graceless. What a word. That's why I said this thing is deep. It's deep. It's deep. Get the books. We need the battle of life. Get it. You don't die before my glory. Get it. All those books are very powerful. From to destiny. Get it. How you can move from cemetery to destiny will bloom. Get all those people, they will bless you. Excuse me, let me give room for us to pray. I want us to pray. I want you to pray. Yes, all my prayer partner, sir. hold your mic. Yes, sir. Pray this prayer. Pray this prayer. Every day waiting for me. Every day at the waiting for me. of my glory. At the junction of my glory. <laughs> Every death waiting for me at the place of the glory. We come Lift up your two hands. Yes, Lord. I want to prophesy for you. Please, every parent, I want you to say amen for this. Every power that wants to kill your children. Yes, Lord. If your amen don't die, I command them to die by fire. Yes, Lord. That glory you are looking ahead of you. Yes, Lord. If you are a man thunder, enter into peace in the name of Jesus. You will not die before your glory. Amen. Your glory will manifest. Amen. Jesus' name we have prayed. Now, if you are not born again, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus. 